So I'm gonna add some olive oil to a pan over medium high heat and I'm gonna go ahead and take some thinly sliced top round steak that I've marinated in some garlic and a little bit of lemon juice and some uh, just basically like Thai sort of seasonings I would say like kind of giving it a, like an Asian feel I'm gonna go ahead and add this to my pan here and just quickly cook this we don't want to leave this in there for too long because this is such a thin cut of meat I'm just gonna go ahead and brown this in the pan and I'm going to quickly take it out and set it to the side so we can continue cooking our vegetables for this Korean style stir fry. So now I took my meat out of the pan and set it aside. I'm gonna go ahead, just add a little bit more olive oil. Now I have myself a stir fry kit with some Brussels sprouts, carrots, um, kale, I believe, and some snap peas, but I'm gonna set that aside. And I'm gonna add to my pan some sliced red peppers, some onions, a little bit of garlic, and a little bit of ginger and Thai paste. Now I'm gonna add some soy sauce, add in those vegetables back into the pan from the stir fry mix, and then I'm gonna go ahead and add some of the, um, it's called like Korean bibimbap paste. And that's gonna give us a great flavor to saute all these vegetables for our stir fry in red pepper, onion, a little bit of a chopped Now you're gonna wanna cook this chili, down for probably about 15 to 20 garlic. minutes on medium. And you I can turn it down below. You can go ahead and put the cover the back on the pan if you need you. to. It's and you just wanna make sure all the vegetables get sauced and they all get nice and, and tender. That's one of the most important things. So keep cooking that down and you're gonna wait till the last minute to add your meat back in and stir everything because you don't want that meat to get rubbery and overcooked since it's sliced so thinly and we've already browned it. So I added the meat back in the pan, stirred everything around, checked all my vegetables, and went ahead and made myself up a bowl of this yummy Korean spicy stir fry that is so great for the perfect weeknight meal. I don't know anybody that would not love this.